Hey guys, welcome to Sam 610. So in today's video, I want to talk about working remotely versus being in the office. And I just want to go over my thoughts of being back in the office versus working remotely. As I had mentioned in my last video, I am in the office three days a week now and I work remotely two days a week. So with my schedule, and of course I'm not going to say where I work due to privacy concerns, but with my schedule, I was allowed to pick two days a week that I can work from home. So right now I am going in the office Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday and staying home on Thursday and Friday, which to me is great because you can knock out the first three days, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, and then just you know be home, you know, get on your grind on Thursdays and Fridays. So the benefits with being in the office, I will go over that part first, is being able to collaborate with others and get to actually talk to people um, you know when you're remotely you know when you're working remotely it's a little bit different because you're on teams and you know depending if you have your video turned off and on you may or may not see that person which i'm okay with because when you talk to people on the phone through your iphone or through your smartphone whatever kind of smartphone you have you don't get to see them unless you facetime them or something like that so being able to get that interaction is kind of nice um, being able to see people you know, and on the flip side of that, I have to say working remotely, I, I kind of feel like I'm in my zone. I feel most comfortable because, you know, as you guys know, we all went through a pandemic, you know, and I worked remote, you know, two and a half years before going back into the office. So it's definitely a different atmosphere going back into the office because everybody, you know, within the building is on a hybrid schedule. So some days you get to see some of your team members and some days you do not get to see your team members, um, depending what type of schedule you're on. Um, but they do have something worked out where everybody has to be there at least you know one day a week where you're all together in the office on that day to collaborate and to you know meet with your teams and have meetings and all that fun stuff um, you know group lunches whatever they want to do uh, training stuff like that just give you guys an idea um, you know personally for me i like being able to work remote and the reason why is because you know again through the pandemic you're you know within your zone you don't have to worry about you know going in you know when people are you know sick and you know if i'm sick i don't have to worry about being around other people you know whether it's just a you know a common cold or you know hopefully not COVID, uh whatever you know i'm kind of past that part of it i'm not really um as you know as nervous or as scared as i was being around other people since you know i am you know fully vaccinated i do have the booster and again I'm not, you know, I'm not going to go into all that because everybody has their own personal beliefs and that's not what this video is about. I'm just going to kind of give you guys the plus and minuses. So I'd say that's one of the pluses, you know, working remote. You don't have to worry about going to the office sick. You don't have to worry about being around other sick people. Um, you know, of course, there's options available. You can wear a mask or whatever if you want to. And, you know, if they're not feeling good or you're not feeling good, you can do that. Uh, they do have a policy they're supposed to wear it if, if you know if you're exposed or around somebody who has COVID and you're experiencing symptoms you're supposed to wear a mask in, in the office or whatnot um, some people do which is kind of nice because then you kind of know if they're not feeling well or if that's just what they're doing because you know they're not vaccinated or maybe they are vaccinated and decide they want to wear a mask just because that's how they feel safe and i thought about doing that myself and then i said you know what i'm vaccinated i'm boosted you know i'm you know of course i'm taking a risk by not wearing one or whatever but that's just my personal thing. I, you know, I did it for so long. I just kind of want to move past that. So that's one of the pluses, you know, being home. And, you know, for me, another, another plus being remote, you know, full remote, you know, if I had that um, option to be able to full remote, I, I think I would want to choose full remote. You don't have to worry about being micromanaged and, you know, people watching over your shoulders and, you know, people walking by and staring at your screen, wondering what you're doing. I'm home and I know what I need to do and I, I get that done. You know, of, of course you take bathroom breaks, you take a lunch break, you might get up and get, you know, get something and drink or whatever, but I'm not fooling around. They, you know, they can check your internet history. They can see if, if, you know, if you're actually working, you know, and if you weren't, then of course they wouldn't be able to, you know, they wouldn't, you know, companies wouldn't offer you this hybrid model. You know what I mean? They wouldn't, you know, they wouldn't trust you and they would know you're messing around and not doing what you should be doing. So. You know, that, that's another thing I, I like being at home because I'm that person watching over you when you're training. I'm more into, you know, hands-on training. I'm actually a team lead, in, you know, where I work. And again, I'm not going to say, what, you know, where I work or what I do. I'm a, I'm, I'm a team lead in, you know, the financial services, the financial industry, 
Um, actually, it's within banking, I will tell you that, so I'm a team lead within banking, but I'm not going to go into it any further than that because of, again, privacy concerns, guys, this is YouTube. Um, so that, that's, that's a plus. I don't like, you know, for me, I don't like being micromanaged. I don't like people watching over you. And if I train people personally, I like to be able to, to you know, have you sit there and put you in the driver's seat and just, you know, kind of navigate you through what to do. Um, that, that I guess that's one of the benef one of the pluses of being in office because you can sit next to them and watch them do it. However, it's a virtual world. You know, we're on you know Microsoft Teams. You know, whether you're on Zoom, you can still do the same thing. You know, I, I have two monitors. You know, behind me, um, so I'm able to do it that way as well. So um, you know, it's you feel more comfortable. You know, I, I have I'm surrounded by windows in the room I'm in now. You guys can only see a few of those windows here, but I have windows all around me in, in my office space, so I can open up a window where I work. Um, I do have a window seat, which is kind of nice, but the window does not open. It's an office building, so it's nice to get some fresh air in. I don't have to worry about the temperature, whether it's hot, whether it's cold. I can control my own temperature here. Uh, if you're in an office setting, you, you can't control that temperature because, you know, either they have a password on it or it's locked and you just can't change it. So, you know, there's no there's no medium in between there. You're either hot or you're cold or, you know, it is what it is. I'm near a window, so it does get a little bit hot. Uh, but I do have a shade I can pull down if I want to. But, you know, one of the pluses, again, working remotely, I can control my own temperature, so which is really nice, guys. Um, so, uh, of course, another plus uh, working remotely, of course, guys, is the gas prices. The gas prices are absolutely insane. I don't know where gas is, where you guys are, but where I'm at, it's uh, for regular gas, it's $4.99 a gallon. It hasn't gone over that $5 mark yet. Um, I'm not going to get into politics. That's not what this is about, guys. But, you know, I like being able to save gas. That's why, you know, I prefer to work remote. Um, you know, I'm lucky that I can at least work remote two days a week. Um, so if my vacation schedule gets messed up or I'm on PTO, pay time off, um, or I'm not feeling well, I don't have to make up those extra days in the office, which is kind of nice. You don't have to do that. But um, I like being able to be remote because I don't have to worry about driving around and gas and, you know, mileage, stuff like that. Um, I know a lot of companies are shutting down their buildings, you know, and they're they're getting you full remote. They're making you full remote. They don't have to worry about those expenses for the, you know, the electric, you know, the phone, all those utilities. Like when I go into the office now, I just use my laptop for my phone. We don't have um, a telecommunication system. Like I don't have a physical phone where I just pick up. So it's it's newer. You know, it feels more modern in today's world. You know, going to the office, not having a phone, you know, and that type of thing. Um, you know, but I, I just, I don't know, all around, you know, I like working remote because of these things that I had shared with you guys. Um, you know, are you guys full remote, hybrid? Um, are you in the office, you know, five days a week? Let me know, guys, in the comments. I'd be curious to know. So I just wanted to go over real quickly, you know, in this video, what my pluses and minus are. Of course, working remotely for me outweighs being in the office, guys. You know, I, I love it. Um, I guess we got spoiled by it during this pandemic, you know, two and a half years, you know, we're going back now and it's kind of like, you know, people want more and a lot of companies are having trouble, you know, holding, you know, holding their employees in place that have, you know, that are, that are quote unquote veterans in the company. You know, I have 10 years in where I work. Um, you know, of course, again, I'd rather be full remote, but it's not going to happen from what I understand where I work. They're not going to take away days and, you know, they're not going to add more days into the office. So it's going to be three in, two out. Um, you know, it is what it is. But, you know, all in all, again, guys, I, I would love to be full remote. So <laughs> if anybody from my job sees this, hey, you know what? It is what it is. I'm making a video about, you know, the pluses and minuses of being in the office is, you know, being in you know working remotely as an employee so i want to know what you guys think what you guys are doing let me know in the comments um, i wanted to get my feelings out there and share this with you guys um, some of you may think i'm a full-time youtuber and i do this for a living but if you check out my views guys you guys will know i am not a full-time youtuber uh, i could not make a living um running you know working off this youtube channel hopefully in the future i would love to do that and then i can be full remote and then I can make my own hours. I can make videos when I want. I, there's a lot of YouTubers that I follow, um, you know, that they only make videos like once a week or, you know, something like that or once a month if, if you know, they, if they really benefit from YouTube. But 
I'm not there yet. I don't even know if I'll ever get there yet, guys. But I'm going to keep pushing and, and, you know, I'm going to keep throwing stuff against the wall and see what sticks, guys. And this is a video I had in my pipeline, you know, in my, in my head, in my brain. I wanted to make a video, you know, remote versus, you know, in office. And I didn't write this down. This isn't scripted. This is just off the top of my head. I've been thinking about it, you know, for a few weeks now that I want to do this video. So, again, guys, let me know in the comments, you know, what your situation is, if you like it. You know what you what you like about it what you don't like about it um, you might not even be working I don't know let me know in the comments that you know as well um, I would really really appreciate if you guys come across this video if you hit the subscribe button and, and drop me a like it lets me know that I can create more videos like this more open and more honest videos you know um, to what's going on in today's world guys I'm not gonna do politics and news and stuff like that but this is something I think that's you know that everybody's going through you know from the pandemic and everybody's starting just to bounce back and I want to know you know how you guys are bouncing back so again guys if you like the video please give me a thumbs up as always guys later